V present lighted, explicit illumination control for image generation. Using the sun direction with solid angle and geometry information, we predict direct shading to control the lighting of text to image diffusion models. Our method has two main parts. First, we generate a real world dataset of pair image, estimated normal, and estimated shading maps together with predicted text prompts. Then, we train a control module for a pre trained diffusion model conditioned on normal and shading information. This approach allows us to train on real data. A simple lighting representation would be using endotel shading. However, this representation does not provide information about cast shadows. We propose to use direct shading which contains both shading and cast shadow information. Cast shadows play an important role in the lighting quality. To obtain real-world direct shading maps, we develop a shading estimation module. From an input image, we predict pixel-aligned features, then unproject them to a 3D feature grid. Using a 3D CNN, we predict the density grid, where we trace rays towards the light source to obtain a core shading map. Additionally, we refine the shading map using image information to achieve high-quality shading. Our method enables shading estimation from only a single view. As our main image generation module, we use stable diffusion. To control the lighting of the generated images, we design a control module conditioned on normal and shading maps. However, the control signal is not always well maintained. Therefore, we decode the control signal during training and apply a reconstruction loss to achieve identity preserving control. Our method enables generating images under the same lighting condition using various prompts. We can even interpolate between the prompts, but the lighting stays consistent. The lighting is consistent with the target shading even under varying lighting conditions, as it can be well observed on the dome. Using the same lighting, we can also generate multiple variations of the same scene. Note how the hard shadows and the shading are maintained. We compare our representation against endotel shading. Although global lighting effects are inferred by the model, precise control over the shadows requires direct shading. The shadow regions do not contain any information. Conditioning on the normals helps to maintain the desired geometry. As a downstream application, we propose diffusion relighting. We extend our dataset with random target shading and predicted relit images. We use the same module as before, but now we condition on the input image and the target shading. This way, we can utilize the diffusion prior for relighting. Our method gives realistic relighting with consistent materials. Besides hard shadows, our method enables delighting effects as well by changing the solid angle. Identity preservation is crucial for relighting. ControlNet is prone to losing control signal and gives reddish relighting results with two soft shadows. Our control decoder helps to maintain the color information. Our full model gives more stable training with improved identity preservation. Existing relighting methods are usually trained on small or synthetic datasets leading to artifacts and real-world samples as visible in the shadowed regions. Our method utilizes the real-world prior of a pre-trained diffusion model which helps generalization. For further details, we refer to our paper. Thank you for your attention.